Hey, Collective, let's see what messages come out for you guys today. These readings are for entertainment purposes only, so please don't make anything fit and don't put anyone above your own intuition, okay? We're going to start with the Red Oracles and let's see what comes out. I feel like someone has gotten used to something that was just supposed to be an experience. You may have gotten comfortable with something that you was just supposed to experience for a short period. But let's see what comes out for y'all. If y'all see any smoke, that's just my Palo Santo. Spirit messages do you have for the collective? Please and thank you. What messages do you have for my collective? Please and thank you. What's the message? We have by the book, Deep Knowing. There could be something here with a leader. Someone could be a single parent. There could be something here with a twin flame. It's deep knowing. Some of y'all have a deep knowing of what this is. You were supposed to just experience. I feel like you were supposed to just experience something for a short period. You may have gotten comfortable with that. And so spirit could be trying to push you out of it. Or giving you signs. You could be getting signs from the universe. Especially with this deep knowing. Also, there's some things going on behind the scenes, okay? You see this moon here. Someone could be trying to hurt somebody. That look like the death owl right there. Someone could be dealing with an Aquarius or a celebrity with this star. Mmm. Somebody could have even been trying to switch something with you. What the hell? What's at the bottom? Unfinished symphony. Okay. So let's see what this is. Spirit. What's the message? I feel like somebody's trying to switch something out with your child. Because yours was bigger than theirs. I feel like you standing on something, though. Whatever whatever that's going to mean. Like, if you say no, that's what you're standing on. If you say yes, that's what you're standing on. But there could be some things going on behind the scenes as well. All right, Spirit, what's the message right here with this by the book? Somebody feel like they got to do something the right way. And with this unfinished symphony, somebody could feel as if they have unfinished business with you. Something could have ended with this 10, but something could be coming back around. All right. Spirit is also stopping something. Oh, let's see what comes out. Spirit is in this, this, and this. What's the message? High Priestess and the King of Pentacles. There could be a King of Pentacles that's a High Priestess. Or some of you could have a deep knowing. Because this High Priestess is just clarifying this deep knowing. With this 11 right here with, with your intuition. Some of y'all have the deep knowing of King of Pentacles. What is King of Pentacles doing, child? They coming back, child. They is coming back around for something. This King of Pentacles could be doing spell work or trying to manipulate a situation to go in their favor. Okay? They is trying to switch something out with you, too. Yeah. Karma. This person was trying to switch karma. I just saw the... Or your destiny. Okay, I just saw the Wheel of Fortune. They're trying to switch your destiny or something. Yeah, like, you could be in this 10 of 1. You're not supposed to be. So don't get comfortable here. Don't get comfortable right now. Okay? Spear, what in the world is this? Because what? I just saw the 10 of Swords. Eight of Pentacles. Somebody couldn't sabotage someone more. Y'all, the same energy keep coming out. It's time for you to just stand up and defend yourself when, when it comes to this situation. All right, what's this to just fail? Eight of Pentacles. Um, you could have had your head down at work. Look at this card. Could have been working on yourself. You had your head, had your head down at work. Okay, King of Swords. 
Mm. I feel like somebody needs to tell you something as well. But why do I feel like whatever this person coming to tell you could cause a towel? Because I did a reading last week where I was like, uh, this person, they was going to call you when it was a group of people around. Because like, they wanted everybody to hear whatever this was they're about to say and it wasn't nothing good. So this King of Pentacles, they are manifesting something. Mm. Yeah. Eight of Pentacles with the Ten of Pentacles. Spirit, what's the message right here? This person could have been holding back from you. This could be somebody who has like a city job or something in the city. We be in the city. Hey. This person could be from Atlanta. Or you guys could be from Atlanta. We have a Queen of Swords. So we already saw the King of Swords and the Queen of Swords. Four of Cups. Maybe this person wants you to miss some type of opportunity. Seven of Cups. Somebody's trying to do a switcheroo, y'all. So y'all gonna have to take this how it's gonna resonate. But with this by the bull, I feel like spirit. Because remember I said spirit stop something right here. Something could have been going on for a long time. Spirit is stopping something. Yep. Because I feel like somebody was trying to come around and do something again. Yeah, you may have even had to persevere through something. With this strength card. But it's coming up in the reverse. Wow. And then you have the Queen of Wands and the Three of Swords. Somebody, I feel like this person, they want you to feel some type of way with this unfinished symphony. Page of Swords, Ten of Swords. This is somebody from your past child. Yep, Six of Cups. Cut the deck on the Six of Cups. Yep, and then and they in the Five of Swords energy. And it could be a King of Wands. But this person is like creating a lot of problems for you, a lot of drama for you. Wow. Oh, this shit never gets old. Yeah. It, it never gets old. Somebody wanted something to go in, in their way or their favor. But this person, realized, maybe they realized they did too much or something with their five of cups. They could have got a, a third party involved. Yeah, with the three of swords. And there's three people on this Six of Cups. So, it's like this. Because we got the Queen of Wands. We saw the Queen of Swords. We got the Queen of Wands. We saw the King of Swords. And we got the King of Wands. And we got a King of Pentacles up here. But some of y'all, you could have been dealing with this person in the past, right? And then you could have moved on and started focusing on something. Whatever this Eight of Pentacles was. This person that came back around from the past, and I got, I feel like they got somebody with them. And baby, this is the type of energy of like, well, I'm gonna send my sister over there to beat your ass. <laughs> or I'm gonna send my cousin over there. Like, this King of Wands was doing the most this for the hostess. Maybe they're trying to put on for people. I don't know. But anyway, what else we need to see, Spirit? What else we need to see right here? So somebody was trying to get you comfortable in something. This King of Pentacles, I feel. The King of Pentacles and the King of Wands could be the same person, or they could be two different people. But with this magician energy, somebody was trying to get you comfortable. And yep, comfortable in the Five of Pentacles. Hmm. I don't know why, but this is what this person, the spirits that don't get comfortable, you're supposed to experience that. Some could have been going on. Now, with these pinnacles, I'm getting five years. Uh, this could be somebody from five years ago. So, what was that? 2018? No, 2019. So, it's somebody you met back then. 
and they could add in dealing with you and another person. Yep, Knight of Wands, King of Swords. Somehow these people know each other. There could even be competition. There could be competition for this Queen of Wands. Man or woman. But you got a king of wands in this five of swords. Yeah, that's competition. Ace of Pentacles. But somebody on this board right here wanted you to feel comfortable in the five of pentacles. For some, it's just that's what they wanted you to be. For others, it's so they could do this. Some of these people wanted you to see that they done came up from the past. <laughs> Someone who hurt you in the past, child. It could have even caused you to go through some type of awakening. It could have gave you some type of strength. Maybe this person's trying to take that away. Whatever your strength is, they could have been trying to take that away from you. What else, spirit? Tell. I told you something that this person, I said, whenever they tell you this, I feel like it's going to cause a tower. Let's get the overall emotion of this. Breathe. Courage. Maybe they need courage to come and tell you this. <coughs> yeah, I feel like this is what somebody wanted you to feel. Five of Pentacles, three of Swords. But don't, don't get um, comfortable in this energy. Okay? But some of y'all, some could be going like going on with a lot of women around the world. But I feel like these is your ancestors and your spirit guys, which is why the cards say, I know that I'm never alone. Somebody wants you to feel by yourself. For real. Yeah. With these relationships. But it says I'm attracted to those who serve my higher good because I don't feel like I don't feel like that's what this was doing. It like somebody was just coming back around to hurt you. Maybe this person got pride. Or you could be dealing with a Leo. Something like that, y'all. Let's pull these. You can deal with a earth sign, air sign, fire sign. That's why spirits say don't get comfortable in that energy. Embracing enthusiasm. You about to shout to the heavens with happiness. Maybe this is somebody who's trying to block that. Yeah, blessings are showering your life. Reaching your destination, your light shines brightly, child. There's something with the four. These four eggs have been put up. And somebody's been, like, watching over them for you. Something could have took a whole year. How that song go? It took a whole damn year to repair my body. The one by Mary J. Blige. So this is what's coming in for you. And maybe this person know it. Some people know it. Maybe you're dealing with somebody that don't want to see you happy. Spirits just trust that there's a divine plan. Because a lot of shit going on behind your back. Behind the scenes. Traveling and lightning. Uh, transformation. Yeah. A fresh new way of living emerges. I don't know who this was that wanted you to be comfortable in that five of pentacles, but baby. Mm -mm. What else, spirit? Let's pull some of these, just see what come out. Like somebody could have been with the magician on the eight of pentacles. Somebody could have been doing something with your job. Uh, a situation that needed resolution will be resolved and healed. And then I just say it took a whole year to heal, repair your body. It says it may be time to replenish your energy and fully energize to prepare for what's next. Because I feel like this King of Pentacles could have been like, shit, maybe somebody was harvesting some, someone's energy, harvesting someone's energy. So I have a 
you're doing something, yeah. I just saw entertainment, spirituality, and science. Y'all know I don't like when the science card comes out. So they definitely, somebody definitely could have been harvesting your energy. But there's a change for the better coming in here. <coughs> so I feel like the main thing in this reading was not to get not to get used to that five of pentacles in the river. Strength in the river. Somebody could have really been draining you, child. It's crazy. I watched the um this this guy. It was it was a lady, but it was these men talking. First, she was talking about men draining women. Um, through different means, but he had a lot of women because he was draining them, getting energy from them. Maybe somebody became a king of pentacles from draining people. And she said they knew full well what they was doing. Especially if this king of pentacles is a high priestess energy. Right next to that magician. Mm, mm, mm. So you really might have to heal with that four swords. You may have had to heal. Yeah, now nah, somebody was draining the fuck out your ass. Nine of cups. This person could be on a board. It's like they at home and they house shoes and they house coat. Probably draining the fuck out your ass. Could be an emperor. Could be someone's father. Somebody was doing a lot. Damn. What else, spirit? The justice. But it's, it's time for justice to come through now. That's why I'm saying don't get used to being in that ten of wands, five of pentacles. Three of pentacles. Yeah, people was definitely collaborating. Cups mm, and the moon, because I, I mean, when I tell you, it's a lot of shit going through. It's a lot of shit going on behind the scenes, and I just saw the devil card. Doing the devil this was either someone's friend or somebody's third party that was doing this shit. Three of Pentacles, three of Cups, three of Swords, and it's three people in this Six of Cups energy. Maybe this man brought a lot of women. Okay, if you are a woman, this man brought a lot of women around you to, to cause a lot of problems. If you are a man, this girl brought a lot of men around to cause a lot of problems. But for some of y'all, there's some type of competition for some of y'all. Okay, I feel like you are protected while this shit is. People could be sending people to you to get information just so they can tennis swords you block you and stop you. For some of y'all, somebody could have been trying to stop a connection with the Ace of Cups. Child, people be doing too damn much. <laughs> people be doing too much. What else here? What else going on? But you know what? Be mindful with this Ace of Pentacles. Some type of tangible offer, but if you had to go through all of this right here, unless something is in court, then that's different. But if these kings moving like this, just so they could come in and do this, because y'all know I had did a reading like a year or two ago. I said the same person that will cause you to lose a job would be the same person that makes some type of offer to you. And I already said high priestess, king of pentacles, magician with the eight of pentacles. This person could have been doing something to your damn job. Or something, child. What else, spirit? Seven of Wands. Somebody wants your defenses to come down. And they want you to take a leap. They want to get you, like, defenseless. Be mindful. Strength in the reverse. Seven of Wands in the reverse. What is this? What was this person of... Queen of Swords could be someone's sibling, or this could be somebody else's person that's doing this shit to you. What? 
Why do they want this person in the seven of wands in the reverse? Yeah, that's why. Listen. But you got to think, like, what type of partnership would it be? If this person has to do all of this just to make an offer. It, you can imagine. This person may be very controlling. Um, and it is really they want what you got. This masculine want what you got. Whatever's in your cup. He reach, He hold it tight to his cup. And he reaching out for yours. Some of y'all could be uh, in this star energy. You could be an Aquarius. Or something about your, uh, your energy is very healing. Because this water reminds me of those healing waters that people, those bodies of water people go to, they get healed. Your energy is very healing. So somebody did all this shit. Five of Pentacles, Ten of Wands, Three of Swords. Probably sent a hate group on you just so they can come in. Hell no. I can't tell y'all what to do, but just be mindful. Because this card says I'm attracted to those who serve my higher good. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, with so ace of swords. I don't know if this would be for your higher good. This could be this person's family could be doing this as well. So you know what type of relationship that would be. Every time you fart and it's wrong, they gonna run to their family. Their family gonna have some it's gonna always be them with their family against you. Try to defend yourself. That reading I did the other day, I said, you know what? Some of y'all were in a situation where the King of Swords needed to speak up. And they wasn't. They hadn't been. They had not been speaking up or standing up for you. They was allowing their family to do a lot. And they just sitting there watching. Some of them felt like, well, you shouldn't say nothing. Maybe some, some people collaborated and did some shit right there. You know that move I, I woke up and it was on last night. There was this granddaddy who was a commander. Damn, what was the name of that movie? But, uh, I mean, he was putting that motherfucker through all kind of tests, child. So, I don't know. Y'all gotta be mindful. If somebody's doing all that, you just don't need it. It's too heavy. It's too much. Look at it from a different perspective. The death card with the five of quick. But some of y'all, this already ended. This is already ended. Well, I said that. But then this person's trying to come back around. What the fuck they gonna say? Sorry I let my family treat you like shit. Sorry I didn't stand up, speak up. Or sorry I cheated with the three of cups. Sorry. Man, it's all kind of shit coming out the cups. I don't know. Just be mindful. Mm -mm, Y'all don't record. I'm recording. I'm recording. Y'all please be mindful. I don't think so. What else? Yeah. And swords. This is really how somebody wants you to feel, child. Or be. Maybe they want to keep you stuck so they can continue to siphon your energy. Because I feel like this is you. So somebody will keep you stuck so they can siphon your energy. Mm -hmm. This is somebody who missed the opportunity. They chose to miss this opportunity. Yep, two of swords. They chose to miss this opportunity with you. And so anything that's trying to come your way, this person want to come back around and stop it. King of one with the five of, of swords. But some of y'all, they in a whole nother relationship. Why they ain't over there enjoying it then? Baby, they can't. They over here watching you and gossiping. What else, spirit? <laughs> this could be a male doing some type of damn uh, spell work on someone or something. Anything else, spirit? Yeah, ten of wands. Ten of wands with this queen of cups. The Will of Fortune, the Ace of Wands, and the Ten of Pentacles. I feel like that's what's coming towards you. I don't feel like... So, you you got two. 
offers. You got an Ace of Pentacles that's coming from some bullshit. And then you got a Ten of Pentacles. So be mindful when this comes through. Because like I said, if it was meant for you, somebody wouldn't have had to do all this shit right here. There's something about you that's very healing or something. Or something about this person. Y'all got to take it how it resonates. It could be your safe room. Remember I said they was draining people through sex. Sacral. You are highly sensitive to chemicals, additives, processed foods, and energies right now. Respect your sensitivity by avoiding harsh items, situations, and relationships. This is too much. It will be too fucking harsh for you. So let the past go. Because remember I said something from the past come back around? Let that shit go, child. What's that? Yeah, I, I knew it. I said that with a damn star card. I said, this person wants your energy. Because your spiritual power brings great blessings in loving service to the divine. That star, that star right there, this person, hmm, they may have became a, a ten of pentacles out of your energy. Who are we? I feel like it would be too much. Why well, I feel like that card gonna come out and say, uh, take the opportunity to forgive. You can forgive them where you at. Energy, I'm, your hands and your heart are activated to give healing energy. I literally just said there's something about your energy that's very healing. It's very healing. But shit, they ain't got nothing to offer you. Hello? This person ain't got shit to offer you. Alright? Change in direction. Vacuum away the fear. Throat sharper and brand new beginnings. So y'all, please be mindful. There ain't nothing to worry about. You're safe in the situations under perfect control of the divine. Cause I say spirit stopping something right there. With your with your in this light work and sacred chakra, child ain't no telling how long why people was trying to keep you stuck so they could keep fucking draining you. And so spirits like enough is enough. Okay, so that's what I have for y'all. And this person knew what they were doing, too. That's why they still still uh, watching you and doing it. Still trying to drain you. They may be trying to come back and just have sex with you just to get your energy. But some of them, we saw that science card with that magician. They don't even need... What, how's that reading I did? I said for some of y'all, they don't need to be near you to do it. Maybe there's something with uh, hypnosis or some shit. So y'all, please be mindful. Stay prayed up. Stay protected. And leave this shit where it's at. Okay? Till next time.